up what's up my good people it's a girl experience mbithe here hey hey and i'm back nimerudi kwa malizia what i started there's that video that i did yeah my first time and i'm sure siku ambia whatever you all were expecting to hear but today i'm here to give you all the tea the tea is here call everybody call police yes i'm here to give you the tea so i asked my whatsapp people when you have a few interesting questions that they'd like to know hey hey now how are to they didn't even spare me so let me just jump right into the video okay i'm scared the kind of questions that i was asked including the very very sweet sweet question that you all have been waiting for here it's coming up in this episode so make sure you watch the video to the end eh? to the end mpaka mwisho yes so let me start obviously i always like writing my my things so hey hey the first one was are you married or are you cohabiting well by the masculine lumpia kenya imetokea ni nasema unless you are married legally is zingine ni come stay and and in any case you guys divorce if you are married legally you go with whatever you came with so ya kama ulikuja hapo ukiwa umesimama na tungu watu wako pia na tungu watu wako pia you go so you guys hey do you work hard out there so for me literally like ni kama tu tuna cohabit let me just say that because i'm not married legally wehe see ni mbaya i'm not married legally so does this mean that he's just my boyfriend ufai kumuita habi unafaa tu kumuita aje hey boy see he kenyan slows are gonna kill me anyway the second one is what's my plan when i hit 30 years you guys hey do you know how old i'm turning this year we 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 hata kuisema publicly inaurumisha inaogopesha i don't even know how to say it cuz we hey hey i'm not liking it at all at all i'm not liking the age that i'm turning this year so soon i'll be hitting 30 so I'm going to watch my plan and I hit that. Where the big that? Where the book ya sikiasi tutajua tukifika hapo. Anyway, people don't reveal their plans. You know, maybe I'll do a birthday party when I'm turning 30, then maybe I'll reveal some of my plans, but right now the goal is to succeed, you know. So I was asked what's my favorite or dream vacation e i think everyone that watches my videos na ananifuatilia vizuri i always mention it nikiambiwa ni seme anything about me where i'd love to go manze mimi napenda zanzibar zanzibari hey that highland we hey hey I really really love that highland manze siju the first time nitapata mapesa vizuri I can miss the end to Mombasa. I miss you I just go to Zanzibar for a whole week. Enjoy because I damn 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 love that place. The vibe na kafiti, though ni ka Highland na mimi na phobia yangu ya maji, but tutapambana. Tutapambana kabisa kabisa. This year you gonna see me like this for a while, eh? Si na kafiti lakini na poa. So, I was asked which family planning method do you use and its effect where he for the moms who are here i'm a for the moms to be here where you know how family planning can really really like mess you up by the time you know the kind of family planning unaitajika kutumia where utakuwa umezunguka but in my life i've only used i've only used the the depot the three months injection and it didn't take me well well i'm usually small but it made me even more smaller so nika drop dropping it made me get my second baby so right now i use the everyday pill and doesn't have any adverse effects on me the only effects it has 
ni kupoteza periods you know i'm just being realistic here nothing to hide that's the only effect it has on me i don't know what about you kwangu periods zinakujanga sasa yenye zinajisikia <laughs> well now eh eh where here comes the question the juicy juicy question hey how old were you the first time you had sex this is the question i avoided last time because hmm. you know my family watches me as i grow up anyway how old was i i was 19 i was 19 i was in first year yes 19 so now najua mko hapo na calculator mna nikalculatea miaka yangu so that you get to know how old i'm turning this year I was 19. Sitataja mwaka. Yes, nikitaja mwaka mtajua. 19 first year. Ati ni explain details of how I lost it. Yes. You know how person loses their virginity. You know. Obviously you have sex. <laughs> so, another one. How do you feel being a mom? of two yet you do vlogging and how do you balance between motherhood and youtube is any questions mbili ziliulizo are differently but they all meant the same how do i feel being a mom of two manze being a mom of two is the best thing that has ever happened to me previously i always talked about um, my babies they weren't planned i i don't hide this atukukachi ni vitu kasema now it's time for us to have babies so they were not planned but i enjoy i enjoy being their mother i actually enjoy motherhood motherhood is so stressful like kama right now <laughs> like a small baby alikuwa amelala but by the time nimetoa ka tripod kangu na nika set up simu ni vlog akaamka Two minutes after amelala so you see how jogging around motherhood and doing vlogs i'm doing videos for you guys it's hard seriously by the way i just najipanga i just panga myself kama najua today i have to shoot nitamaliza vitu zangu mapema nitatafuta ni penye nitapeleka mtu yashikiliwe just for a few minutes cuz shooting is it take more than 30 minutes yes then i come do my thing so it's a matter of you balancing yourself you arranging yourself kujipanga vizuri usikae tu nda ukisema anga oh mimi ni mama siezi vlog being a mom na nifanya siju nisifanye nini no being a mama ifai kukufanya usifanye anything that's an achievement si burden tendi of acha ni spread sana cuz the questions are too many i think hata zingine i'll be jumping my first experience is a first time mom where you guys i think in itaifanyia vlog of it by by itself my first experience as a first time mom manzi just being honest it wasn't so fine as i expected things were not okay i actually got a little bit of postpartum depression i didn't talk about it i like keeping some things to myself i don't know why even if they hurt me i just like keeping them to myself i try and handle them on my own I don't like burdening people. Yaani by the time I'm opening up to you kwambie akaka kidole kana niuma it will have taken a lot of courage for me to do that because I believe I'm a strong woman. Hey, though sometimes strong people need help, but I believe I'm strong. I believe I can handle some things on my own. So postpartum depression really took a toll on me. I think this is the first time they'll be hearing about it because I never told anyone. Hey, I really became thin at some point. Things were not well. Let me let me not talk about it so much. I think yapa I'll do it. I'll do a video on it on its own so that I can explain whatever happened. Okay guys. So now we start with naingia kwa how my how is marriage life? Yes, how is marriage life? Marriage life manze ni kuweka tu god mbele, ni kungangana, needs commitment. 
you don't expect your partner to do something to do like to do something na huko tu hapo you don't want to reciprocate you expect to be loved and you don't want to love back you have to do it's a two way thing you know si ati ni ya one party mtu mmoja ni yeye ufanya hivi you know sometimes you as a man nezambia bibi yako today he just relax i'll do this and this for you let me cook breakfast for you hata kama atakuletea breakfast in bed just cooking is enough very very enough you know inafanya ngao feel eh hey, at least he appreciates you for what you do and at least anaona uh, maybe kuna kuangana ka challenge or maybe sometimes if you see that your lady doesn't know how to cook like scrambled legs come go around just tell them let me do this for you so marriage is all about commitment for me nimengangana nimengangana wacha nikuambie let me tell you maina nimengangana a story for another day so <laughs> we inspired me to start a youtube channel this is something that i've talked about all along not unless you don't follow me i know who asked this question anyway diana marua inspired me to start a youtube channel i won't go deep into details because for so long so apart from youtube what else do you do i hustle here and there hmm? nafanya kazi ya ku hustle i hustle here and there i'm a mom i'm a youtuber uh, nikisikia kwa kitu kama tokelezea i do so i'm a person i'm a jack of all trades i do all kind of things yes <laughs> na kujo wewe na mnanijima sana he ati when is baby number 3 we baby number 2 ada janiondokea kwa mikono you all are there thinking about baby number 3 we manzi not so soon Amara I don't think kama anakuja wewe wewe economy ya Kenya ni mbaya not unless tuhamie majuu tukangangane huko <laughs> nasikia ngoko ndio kuna greener pastures but anyway guys we baby number 3 hiyo mta hold on kidogo unless you are willing to sponsor me <laughs> ati fe umekula mara ngapi we i've never eaten anyone i've never eaten anyone's fair yes Yeye ni kizungu iko sawa yes i've never where is jawai i'm a good girl say so look like a good girl i can't do that hmm. who is your role model who oh, what's your, who is who inspires you nakwambia kizungu sengine ananichenga hapa my role model i don't know if it's generally in life am anyway i have a lot of role models that i look up to a lot a lot a lot in kenya i look up to diana let me tell you i just look up to that woman um who else i also look up to kate actress that woman inspires me a lot she really inspires me a lot mm, internationally i love zari the boss lady vibes in now manze well you know Ladies, have your mula, have your money, have your money so that yani you get this boss moves. Unapata every man is like anakuogopa, you know, because you have your money. You know, a lot of us ladies wanakuanga easily approached by men. Anakuja anakuambia, you know I got money. You don't have money, but because you need money, unaingia to box. So let's have some boss moves mm -hmm. now how many times do you talk to her in a day in a week mm -hmm. hey, we have busy lives <laughs> we have busy lives where well, when you niuliza hii swali kweni wewe how many times do you talk to her don't you have a busy life somewhere <laughs> miss you how many times we mnataka kunichomea kwa camera niende nikaanze kuambiwa sp does to 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 this and this times where ni watu <laughs> ni watu my my parents watch, watch these things mwache ni kunichomea okay what do i love about content creation i love what i love about content creation is that it has made me come out of my comfort zone you know personally i'm an introvert so me doing content creation at least in Nigeria 
kuwa a little bit extrovert a little bit wewe usidanganya na social media that you see me talking so much kwa kwa keyboard pale mimi keyboard warrior unaambiwa huyo msichana is ni an extrovert we i'm so so introverted so at least i mean to out of my comfort zone it has made me meet people that I never knew I had met them just because of content creation. It has made me made me do things that I never knew I would do just because of content creation. You know, I love love it. I'm just hoping that I'm going to be doing it for the rest of my life. Apart from some evil things come up. So, do you believe in love at first sight? Yes, I do. Do I smoke or drink? Smoking drinking sometimes what keeps me going what keeps me going is that i want to see my success i want to see me succeeding one day so i wake up every day saying no i won't give up because i want to see what the future what life has for me what it has on hold for me you know that keeps me going how old was i when i got married i was 23 some of these questions i've answered previously so naenda mbio mbio did you marry the man you wanted or you just found yourself in marriage i think i did i think i married the man that i wanted story for another day how long have you been together definitely me and my partner we met in 2014 So this is the ninth year since we met but we moved in together in 2018 so this is the fourth year living together but nine years of knowing each other hmm. which other country would you prefer to go maybe and live there mimi manzi acha tunisiwadanganye mimi i go if i ever got an opportunity i would just go abroad life in kenya is so unbearable sometimes well Mm, and soon i'm dreaming of relocating one of these fine days nitasikia tu nimewaambia wase hi guys from uku us i'm from uku uk i'm from uku australia so guys keep it locked in this channel i didn't want to make a long video hizo maswali zilikuwa mingi i've just sampled a few ni mingi we we kumbe watu wanataka kujua mambo mingi hivyo kunihusu anyway guys <laughs> Make sure you subscribe, make sure you like, comment and if possible share, invite your friends over to this channel and let's make life better together. See you. See let me see you on the next one cuz I love love you guys. Thank you for always coming back to this channel for my new subscribers. Karibuni sana. So, bye.